your body is your body. This is what you've got. Love where you're at in your body journey and, you know, be the best you can be. Hello, my friends. It is a beautiful day here in LA, so I just had to take us outside, especially because as you see from the title, today is a swimsuit try-on haul. So it's not gonna be exclusively swimsuits. I also have some like swimsuit cover-ups and kind of like beach to streets wear, if you know what I mean. Like stuff that transforms a swimsuit from a swimsuit to an outfit, which I really like doing, especially like I just got off of a cruise with my family in early January for my mom's 60th birthday. Happy belated birthday, Mama B. Leave the comments down below. All the love to Mama B. We love you. Thank you. <laughs> And on cruise ships and like in a lot of resorts, you're not allowed to like go from the pool to the dining hall and get food in your swimsuit. But you also don't want to like have to go back to your room and change. So in times like that, I really love that kind of transformative poolside or beachwear to restaurant streets real life circumstances. And I know, you know, we're at the end of January now. We're going into like February, March, which is going to be like March break if you're in Canada, spring break if you're in America, whatever break if you're anywhere else in the world. You know, a lot of people are gonna start going on winter vacations to get away from the snow and find some sunshine relief. So I figured it was the perfect time because a lot of different stores are gonna start releasing their cruise collections, which is what it's called when they kind of start their early beach swimwear coming out in February-ish. So I have a bunch of stuff from Airy. You guys know I work with Airy. I'm an Airy Real Role Model. It is just such a fantastic company. They're so body positive. They're so inclusive. And I've been shopping there for what, six years long? Would you say? Six? Way more. Yeah. Well, oh, I've been shopping more. at American Eagle, which is their sister brand, since I was 11, and I'm almost 26. Wow, I'm almost 26. February 8th, get your calendars marked. Molly Burke's birthday is happening. It's a very special occasion. I will be 26 years old. So I've been shopping there for a very long time. I've always loved their swimsuits because when no other brands fit my body, their swimsuits fit my body, which I always really appreciated because mom can attest to this. I always had a big struggle, specifically with my chest. I am very pear shaped. So I'm very petite on top, I'm very curvy on the bottom. I've got your hips, your thighs, your booty. I've got it all, but I'm very small on the chest. I have a really small rib cage specifically. I used to wear like a 30C to 30D cup. Now I've gained a bit of weight, so I'm more like a 32B, 32C. But because of that, I've just always struggled to find proper fitting swimsuits. And Aerie was always my place for swimwear. Their swimwear is actually what got me into Aerie to begin with. So I'm really excited to do this video for you guys. Let's get started with the try on. And I wanna first show you the outfit I'm currently wearing because I'm kind of in love. So this bodysuit is just releasing. They have it in black and I know they have it in like a peachy pink. I'm not sure if they're coming out with it in any other colors, but I love this bodysuit. It does not have the snaps at the crotch, so be warned. And it is like a full booty, it's not a thong, but it's super comfortable. It is this soft ribbed material on the bottom. And then it goes into this beautiful lace kind of under and then on the cups and then it has this cutout with this really nice gold detailing and then the back is like all open lace. I just think this is so sexy. Don't you think so? Yes. I feel I like it's it. like really feminine and sexy, but in a subtle way. And I really love the way I paired it. I mean, I picked the outfit, so obviously I like the way I paired it. But I paired it with like these new joggers that Aerie is coming out with and boots. And then I threw like a Sherpa jacket over it. And I felt like it was this really like comfortable, casual meets like a little bit of femininity with the lace and the plunging neckline. And yeah, so I really love this outfit. These pants my mom has also fallen in love with. They're love them. so comfortable. They have this little faux pocket detailing on the back, drawstring waist, cuffed at the bottom. They're so soft on the inside. I love the color because I think it'll just go with everything. So this is outfit number one, and now we're gonna get into the actual swimwear. We've changed locations. We wanted this nice water background or water feature. I have all the clothes around me that I'm gonna show you and try on. And I'm gonna start with this. Again, it's not swimwear, but I'm a little chilly in the shade actually. So I'm gonna pop my Sherpa on. You guys have probably seen this before because I have like multiple of them and so does my mom. We're big fans of the Sherpa life. Sherpas go everywhere. They go to cool climates, hot climates, cold climates. I feel like in you'll see in this year's role model campaign shoot that I wore like a hot pink Sherpa over for my swimsuit, which was super cute. So it's the same Sherpa that I wore there, but this is just the creamy white color. 
Okay, what do I want to show you first? Let's go with this girl right here. This is a one piece. It is ribbed, so it's textured. Ooh, textured. You know I love my textures. It's not like a high neck, but it's also not a low neck. I have this swimsuit cut in all red, which you might have seen on my Instagram. I'll pop that photo up here. It's the exact same swimsuit, just a different color and texture. I have it in yellow and white stripes. Pop that photo up here. So I'm a big fan of this cut. I love a one piece. If I'm planning to do some like real swimming, one piece, one piece, one piece is the way to go. There used to be zero stylish one pieces. Back when I was a camp counselor, we had to wear one piece swimsuits and there was never any stylish ones. Remember mom? It was so yeah. hard to find. So hard. But now if I was a camp counselor, I would totally be rocking this one. And what I love about this one is it's kind of cute on the back. It's like crisscross all the way down with a tie. I'll show you once it's on. So big fan of that. And then there's a matching bucket hat. Bucket hats became like a real thing last summer and I really think they're here to stay for another season. A lot of people were like kind of controversial about it. I'm a big fan of the bucket hat. I think they're super cute. So let's try it on. Hello, I'm here. I love this. I think it's so cute. Look at this hat, you guys. You can't tell me you don't think this is cute. So I want to show you guys the back of this swimsuit and how pretty it is. It goes low cut, so it's, it's still like feminine and cute, the crisscrosses, but it also allows you to tie it as tight as you want. I love one pieces. I just love one pieces. I don't know. Maybe I'm... I think they suit you. Well, I think so too. Yeah. Because it doesn't like cut me up. Anyway, I mean, I love all swimsuits really, but these pants are so stinking cute. We didn't iron them, so excuse the wrinkles, but I feel like you could wear them even with the wrinkles, frankly. They're like this soft chambray denim looking pant. Jogger really, because they have the scrunchy ankle. They have like nice pockets on the side. They We've got this cute little tie belt and I feel like this is the perfect way to transform a one piece into a bodysuit. And then this is it without it. I feel like it's a really flattering fit. The booty has like good coverage. So if you're into booty coverage, this is one for you to check out. And this is what it looks like without the pants on. I also wanted to show you these shorts as an alternative to the pants if it was like a super hot day. These are so light, so flowy. I feel like they're really flattering on your legs. I love the tie waist again because it's adjustable. So if you've like eaten a little bit more, you need to like kind of loosen it a bit. You got the stretchy waistband and the belt. So super cute. It's got pockets, a back pocket. Love these. The next one I want to show you guys is this. I think this is so cute. I actually have another leopard print swimsuit that I got from Aerie and I just love this. I think it's so cute. And here, let me show you the top. Now I got my tops in a size small. I used to always wear an extra small, but my boobs have been still out a little bit so I decided to go for a size small this still looks like pretty teeny to me so we'll see in the try on how my boobs fit in this first official bikini so I am wearing the size small top definitely glad I got a small not an extra small my boobs aren't spilling out as much as I thought they would be when I first held it up it stretches well it fits nicely I feel like this is the right size I definitely would not have wanted to go up to a medium I know you guys are gonna be like your boobs spilling out I know I don't have much boob but it's still there so it happens I adjusted the strap to be as loose as possible and that feels the most comfortable for me personally. Now I threw on this little skirt with it. What I love about this skirt as a cover-up is it has an elastic waistband at the back. So again, super comfortable. I feel like these styles of skirts aren't always the most flattering on my body type, but I feel like this one really works and it's very comfortable. Now, before I unveil the bottoms of this bikini to you, I wanna have a little body positivity self-love talk. I am not always the most body positive, I admit. I am working on loving my body. I am about, you've heard me say this before, like 25 pounds heavier than I've ever been in my life. I also just came off Christmas, New Year's, and a cruise. So, you know, I'm working on loving my body as it is and where I'm at in my body journey right now. There's a lot going into spring of this like bikini body, get bikini body ready kind of talk. And I think it's super negative. I think if you've got a body and you put a bikini in it, you've got a bikini body. Don't let anybody tell you that your body is not okay the way it is. Sometimes I tell myself my body isn't okay the way it is. And I immediately am like, Molly, stop that. Your body is your body. This is what you've got. Love where you're at in your body journey and you know, be the best you can be. So that's what I'm going to say before I unveil this bikini to you. Don't let feeling self-conscious about your body stop you from like getting in the water and enjoying your time on the beach and like living it up. Okay, done. Do, 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 do. Now I'm wearing a size small in the bottoms, which is typically what I wear in bikini bottoms. And I always wear a size small in one pieces. So these are high-waisted, which 
is nice when you've like eaten a big lunch. And then they're kind of high cut, so you've got some good booty action going on in these. I'm really comfortable in this. What do you think, Mom? Is cute? I think it's so cute. It is so cute. I love it. Do a twirl. <laughs> also, as an alternative, if you get like chilly when it becomes the evening time, you can throw on just like a big oversized sweater, like this ribbed one. <sighs> so cozy. It becomes like just this comfy, cozy dress. Throw on some sneakers with it. I feel like this is like a super cute post beach day look. Now this is the next one I want to try on. And again, it's that really cool ribbed textured material like the one piece I showed. And this is also a size small top, but it seems like it's going to have a lot more coverage. So if you are into more coverage on your chest, but you still like a bikini, I feel like this is a really good one. It also has like really thick adjustable straps. So this seems like even though it's a bikini and it has a bit of a v-neck it's gonna still like hold you in place if you were on the beach trying to do a bit of sports wear like sports action and it's a thicker band around the back and around the bottom it's kind of like a long line so it falls under which i really like and what color would you call this it's like a bronzy brown it's 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 gorgeous i feel like this will look good on so many skin tones yes. same with the leopard print and then either with a tan or a very pale yeah like any skin really tone good. really dark skin tones i think would look great and then these are kind of high cut bottoms so they're a bit more cheeky. I don't know about you guys, but I'm definitely not into like the thong bottom trend that I've seen over the last few summers. A lot of girls can rock it. It's just not my thing. I like my booty to be a little more covered up. So cheeky is about as cheeky as I go, but this still has enough coverage for me. And it has kind of a higher up waistband, higher cut on the thighs. So you'll see that once I try it on and I'll show you some cute little ways to transform it to streetwear. We've got this adorable romper, which is so comfortable. You guys know I struggle with rompers because I'm short torso. I mean, I'm short in general, but especially in my torso. But this one works because it's meant to be just so slouchy. This fabric is my favorite fabric. It's like that just incredibly stretchy, soft, Oh God, it's so comfortable. And this I feel like is one of those pieces you could buy like two sizes too small or two sizes too big and it will still fit you and look cute. I love the back, it's like twisted down the back, which I think is a really cute little detail. It's got pockets, it's got the drawstring, it's perfect. And then let me show you what I'm wearing underneath. Now this top is definitely more full coverage than the leopard print one. I think I actually even could have sized down to an extra small in this one. Like there's definitely enough room in the cups that I could have gone smaller. But that said, the small still fits really well too. And then I've got the small high-waisted bottoms on. They've got like the high cut thighs and the high cut, which I always love because, you know, I've got a bit of a tummy pooch and so it kind of just like nicely hides that which by the way you don't have to hide you can be proud of it but because I'm still on that kind of process of my self-love journey I do feel more confident when I've got like a high-waisted bottom on or a one piece that's just what makes me feel good in my body right now and then this is what the back looks like so there's no clasp on this one you just pull it over your head super comfortable super cute another oversized sweater throw on option I have it on over this swimsuit, it has a raw hem. Oh my God, this material. This is my all time. Can you feel it? uh, it's like. Love it. Oh my God, I love that material. I love that texture. I call it like summer fleece. I don't know. It's like the lighter version of fleece. It has a bit more grit to it. So comfortable. I am in love with this sweater. Isn't this so cute, mom? It's gorgeous. I love this like quarter zip vibe. It's really, I feel like just it hits all the right spots for an oversized sweater it's not too oversized i'm wearing it in a size small i'd usually size down to extra small or even extra extra small in oversized hoodies but i feel like this is kind of the perfect amount of oversized that i wouldn't even size down i don't think what do you think mom i yeah. think it's perfect i feel like this is exactly how it should fit it's lovely and again if you're on a cruise or you're on the beach like it's, a, it's a great little cover up throw this on denim shorts perfect and the last swimsuit I have in this section is my favorite. I am so excited to try this one on. Okay, the color alone is so cute. I love this color. They're a low-waisted bottom, decent coverage on the booty, and it's so soft, this material. It's textured, but it's not the same tight-ribbed as the other ones. I can't even explain it. It almost feels like it could be like a cotton underwear. It's really cool, but my favorite part about it is the top. Look how cute this is. Clearly, you could see this with denim shorts 
shorts and some sneakers. I feel like you could wear this so many ways as like an actual crop top. It has these little cap sleeves. It has the snap down front. It's this beautiful golden mustard color, which again, I feel like on so many skin tones will be flattering. And then the back is like this scoop back, low back. I think this is so beautiful. This is so stinking cute. I feel like this is one of those like ultra trendy ones that you find on a lot of those super cheap fast fashion sites, but better quality and actually fits in a flattering way. I'm gonna stand up. So it has like the cute little buttons. This seriously feels like a top, but I can swim in it. It's so cute. With little sleeves, mom. It's definitely one you can wear as a top. It's yeah, so for cute. Sure. And look at it with these shorts. I love it. I'm obsessed with sweat shorts. It's mostly what I wear when I wear shorts is sweat shorts. It's that same material as that gray sweater. I love it. So cute. And that's the back of the top. It's a cute scoop. Isn't that cute, Mom? It's gorgeous. It's perfect. It's a real molly. And then I'll show you the bottoms. These are the one and only low bottoms that we're wearing. So I wore a size medium in these just because I am a little more self-conscious in low-rise swim bottoms. I thought just to make sure it doesn't cling anywhere, I would be more comfortable and confident in sizing up to a medium. So this is what these look like. Do a little twirl there. This is the booty. They're actually Ooh. quite good coverage on the butt, which I like. Yes. Like I've said, I'm not super into showing off my booty in a swimsuit. What do you think, Mom? Is it cute? I love it. I think it's one of my favorites. I think it's my favorite too, which yeah. is funny. I yeah. It's so many uses. I mean, that top is perfect, you know, to wear with. And I want to show you one other throw over. It's so cute. We love this sweater, don't we, Mom? Love it. But I haven't even showed you guys the best part yet. In the front, you're like, oh, she's wearing like a cute, chunky, knit, flowy sweater. But then, dun, dun, dun. Boom. So pretty. So much sass in the back. <laughs> it is like like a mullet in sweater form. You know, a mullet? business in the front, party in the back. Just another option here for you. I have the shorts on with the sweater. I kind of did like a French tuck. I think that's what it's called, where I tucked the front of the knit sweater into the shorts. I feel like this is super cute. What do you think, Mom? I absolutely love it. I think I it's feel so like cute. The colors go together well, and then at the back, it's still super cute. Yeah, it's really, really lovely. This is probably going to be one of my favorite go-to beach day outfits. I'm not going to lie. So that is all the swimwear and cover-ups I have to show you today. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Just a reminder to not let your own insecurities stop you from enjoying life and enjoying fashion. You know, like I've said, like I don't have a thigh gap. I don't have a six pack, but I don't care because this is where I'm at with my body right now. And even though at times I feel self conscious. I rock it anyways, don't I, mom? Yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, you know what? When I have those moments where I'm like, oh, no, I've put on like a bit of extra weight here or there or like I'm too this or too that or not enough of this. I'm like, you know what? If somebody doesn't like me because this is how my body is or somebody judges me because this is how my body is right now, then I don't want that person in my life anyways. You will see it has definitely not stopped me from wearing a ton of swimwear. You see it all the time on my Instagram. I'm always rocking swimwear. And by the way, I always get questions when I post swimwear, especially in this one right here, where my swimsuits are from. 99.9% .9 of the time, they're from Aerie just because they always have been. I've always loved them. I still have swimsuits like this one. That one I've had literally for like four or five years. So yeah, I love it. Thank you, Aerie, for sponsoring this video and for allowing me to be an Aerie Real Role Model. I love it. I love all the other girls that work on the campaign. They've become some of my best and closest friends. And I feel so grateful to work for a company that's so open-minded and positive. I love you guys so much. Have a beautiful, wonderful rest of your day. And don't forget to comment down below and let me know which swimsuit was your favorite and which cover-up was your favorite. Love you guys. Bye.